All right, hopefully, uh, yeah, I hope you guys don't mind this layout I got going on for now. I still haven't made a proper layout for Terraria. Yeah. Then again, I don't know how much we're going to play this game, like, once we beat the Moon Lord or whatever his name is. Like, unless you want to do, yeah. like, some mods, because I know there's a lot, there's a good modding scene for this game. Yeah, there, there's a lot of nice mods. Like... That could be cool. I know there's one that adds, like, a new campaign. I forget what it's called. I think it's called, like, the... Uh, Calamity? Yeah, that's, that sounds familiar. I know there's one, like, with a bunch of snow and stuff. Yep. Oh, yeah, I forgot I have Defender Medals. Uh, okay. I need to get some iron, and I'm gonna do this in the most wasteful way possible. Alright. So, there's a few things I want to do today. Um, for one, I want to find some life fruit. And I want to yep. throw some life fruit into the shimmer. Because my good buddy Gonsito, he said that you get something good for throwing life fruit into the shimmer. Which I don't uh, know. I'm assuming it's Ambrosia? Potentially. I don't think I have it yet. Because I don't even have max uh, life fruit. I think Ambrosia can be also gotten by throwing any kind of fruit in. Any kind of fruit? Hmm. Any kind of fruit, I think. Well, what other fruits are there? <laughs> I don't recall. Yeah, that's the thing. I mean, you know what? I mean, I, could, I don't mind going down into the caves to get some Oh god. More, we got the turtles. Oh no, not the freaking turtles again. Are they gonna start throwing pizza at me too? Is this a... Ooh, a turtle shell. That's not a life fruit. Oh fuck. Surprise turtles. Surprise, motherfucker. Yeah, I'll, I'll just throw some dynamite all over the place. Oh, I did not know there was a dark uh, trap there. We don't need Animan. We don't need, uh, Palladium, I mean. Right? Um, haven't used Palladium since crafting the armor for it, so... <laughs> not really. Uh, because I got some, uh, Palladium ore, and I'm going to do, uh... As a lazy way of getting iron, I'm gonna turn that into iron. You can probably just sell that stuff. Yeah, but since I don't feel like trying to look for iron, I'm just going to turn the palladium into iron. <laughs> I mean, you do you, really. Yeah, it's it's the lazy way of me trying to get the thing I want. What are you trying to get again? Uh, uh, pump, so I can uh, get the stuff uh, all the way to, uh, like, shimmer over to our base. Oh, right, right. Would be nice. Oh, random bit of corruption. T Surprise! In corruption. the middle of the, in the middle of the jungle. I love when that happens. So before, uh, before you called me and played Terraria, I was um, doing some ROM hacking. <laughs> Ooh. Because I recently learned how to um, hack Paper Mario. And the funny thing is, is it's also like an interesting learning experience because it's kind of I'm kind of learning code for the first time, too. And since I know nothing Ooh, about code, uh, I'm basically just learning this code from scratch. <laughs> and being able to understand bits and pieces of the Paper Mario 64 code, kind of a neat experience. <laughs> Ye. Oh god, skeleton archer. I remember when those guys were annoying. <laughs> I don't know if they still are. They're only annoying in this context because uh, I'm just getting randomly shot at. <laughs> yeah, they're just like, it's like, hello there, you want some fun arrows? Everybody <laughs> loves arrows, He-Man! <laughs> oh fuck, I got some cobalt ore. Neat. Throw that back into the water. Or into the shimmer. Yeah, we don't need that. Platinum. 
Hornets. Gold. Hornets everywhere. I don't want your damn hornets. I I I can see it now. Uh, like people who watch this just cringing at the way I'm doing this. Bye -bye. Just turning palladium into oh, iron ore. Oh, I'm I'm gonna look at my stream a bit. Well, I mean, I see you over in the shimmer. It's a little hard to see because my phone is so small. I got iron ore. All it just right. took me breaking down palladium. And you specifically need iron? <laughs> yes. Wow. Okay, I don't think this is part of the jungle anymore. I did this in the most wasteful way possible. <laughs> Ooh. We trick. can chop down the trees and get some gemstone. Mm, and that's, uh, I don't know. What does what gemstone do again? Uh, I think they've outlived their usefulness for us. Oh, that's too bad. Oh no, my inventory is a frickin' hot mess again. You think your inventory is a hot mess? Take a look at mine. Oh no. Mine's no better. Strange plant. Okay. Wait, what the fuck got shimmered? No, oh, go away, skeleton. This is not the bone zone, He-Man. I forget if we need Chlorophyte for anything else. Did I ever complete my Spectre set? Spectre hood, Spectre rope, Spectre pants. Yeah, I have the full Spectre set. I think I was going to... I got Ethereum block. Ooh. I think I was gonna now make gonna, um, a Spectre helmet, too. Now I'm gonna place the inlet pump into the shimmer. And I forgot my grand design. Grand Oops. design? Flintstones. And I'm falling out of, into the shimmer. Or, through the shimmer. Well, I don't have that shimmer immunity. Time to head on. to the base. Here I am, just trying to see if I can find, like, two more life fruits. If I can find two more life fruits, I can, ma yeah, I can max out my health, and then I can throw one into the shimmer. But my dumbass doesn't know where the life fruits are at. Mm, hopefully I'll find one. If I can remember what they look like. It's been a while. Oh, there's a fuck ton of iron ore in the, uh, chest. <laughs> so I did some shimmer bullshit for no reason. Oh no. Oh no, whatever will I do? <laughs> it just plays the funny oh no sound effect. Oh no. Oh no. Oops, I used the wrong thing. Well, I accidentally went back to base. That's not what I meant to do. I hate when I do that. And then I turn this into... Outlet Pump! Oh, hey, Fallen Star. Nice. And I need my grand design, and then I can just... I should also buy some uh, wires, because I'm going to need a fuck ton of wires. Grand design. Oh, god, the UI is fucked. Uh-oh. <laughs> what happened to the The measuring UI? tool fucks everything. Oh, yeah, the, the grid thing. Yep. That's what I hate about the grand design. Huh. I found- there's another Plantera thing here. I forgot about that. Ooh. Not that I want that. Whoops. Can I sell? You know what? I'll sell my leaf blower because it's kind of useless. Yeah, screw my leaf blower. Screw leaf blowers. They make too much noise. Yeah. How much? You know what? I don't need a turtle shell. I mean, technically, you can make turtle armor. 
turtle armor exists. I didn't think that far, but eh. I mean, it, it's, it's okay. I mean, you get targeted more. Huh. Never, uh... I'll sell the bee goggles. Never looked in this chest before. Breathing... Breathing reed? <laughs> Increases breath time and allows breathing in water. Isn't that just the same thing as the Neptune shell, though, that I have already? Yes, go my dynamite. Alright, more, uh, more chlorophyte here. Uh, I don't think this is part of the jungle anymore. Yeah, this is not part of the jungle anymore. We have officially left the jungle. Oh, and this is the uh, Plantera boss room that we have had. Good times. Good times trying to fight Plantera and absolutely sucking at it. And now she's pretty yeah. easy. Yeah. It went from being a problem for us to now being a minor inconvenience. Yeah, honestly, that sounds about right. <laughs> ooh, ooh, I forgot about this. The, the tax collector. Ooh, we get more moon knee again. Yeah. Oh, there's a life fruit. Perfect. Now I just need one more. I mean, we've already collected most of the life fruits, so getting new ones is kind of a pain in the butt. More hornets. Ah, more hornets. <laughs> I think I have just the one life fruit. Okay, well, let me use this. There we go. Attain maxim maximum health and mana possible. Yep, that's that's good. Alright, what do I don't need half of this stuff? Active stone block? <laughs> Haven't seen that before. Okay, where's the nearest life fruit, though? Somehow I feel like that's gonna be the most annoying thing. Ooh, hey, a mimic. Yeah. Here, mimic. Come here. Don't pussy out on me. Alright, there we go. Oh no, not the turtle again. Go away, turtle, I don't like you. Oh, I blew myself up. It's not good. Oh, hey, more chlorophyte. I mean, I guess, yeah, I guess I could use chlorophyte to get more specter, um, to get that specter helmet. Because you have a full specter set, right? Ye. Yeah. So, we're all decked out on just specter gear in general. And having that lifesteal thing is pretty damn nice, too. Well, I really debate on how much it helped during that, um, during that cultist fight. <laughs> oh, hey, I found, the I found the last life fruit. There we go. Okay. Well, I got a bit more chlorophyte, and then I will go to the shimmer. Fuck that, I'm not dealing with that tortoise, I'm leaving. <laughs> More grid stuff. Alright, so let's sell this stuff. 42 Fallen Stars, when the hell did I get that many? Uh... <laughs> Wait... I, is this a new equipment? Star Cloak. Causes stars to fall after taking damage. Yeah. I have one. Oh, I you also, do? I uh, have it upgraded so that uh, I automatically use a mana potion. An upgraded version. Oh. Also, I have a hollowed key. <laughs> have we gotten one of those before? 
Uh, oh, uh, you, I think you can slap that into, um, uh, a ch an empty chest and you can get, um, some fancy bullshit. An empty chest? Yeah. And it will spawn in a hollow mimic, if I'm not mistaken. Like, as in I just make a chest and put a hollowed key in there, or what? Yeah. You put a hollow key in the chest and it creates a an enemy that can drop something quite cool if i'm not mistaken if it's if it's that thing i'm talking i'm thinking about um let me just double check because <laughs> i could be thinking of a different thing well let's see i mean the hollow key it just says opens a chest in the dungeon oh yeah i am thinking of a different thing yeah it just says unlocks a hollow chest but i haven't found okay the, i don't know if i found the hollow chest in the dungeon That's the thing. <laughs> Hello, Vivian. Not to be confused with the Vivian from TTYD. Yeah. Alright, um... Sell the tungsten. Sell the iron. I guess I'll sell the Star Cloak, since you are, you're already using one. Probably won't take advantage of it. I, I think I also have an extra one. Yeah, so I'm not going to be hurting if I'm if I miss out on it. So if you really want one, I could give you my extra. Oh, fuck! I fell. Mm, yeah. Um. All right. I'll just keep this stuff in my inventory. Actually, no. Oh shit. Oh shit. Where did we put all the materials? I actually. Then? Swapped out to my. Okay. I actually swapped loadouts. Oh, oh no! So I accidentally wasted some uh, wa some uh, what you call it? Some wire or yeah, wire. Well, that's not good. Because I couldn't fly. All right, let's put the Neptune shell away. Put all this away too. Unholy arrows. Some of the Deadly Sphere, Shadow Beam Staff. Yeah, I mean, this stuff is good. Wait, so is the Lightning Oracane only useful during the Eternia Crystal event? Uh, I think you can use it outside, and it would use your mana. I think. I mean, let's see. It says, um... Was I try using it? It doesn't do anything. It doesn't let me use it, even though I have max mana. It says, let's see. Lightning Aura Cane summons a sentry, an aura that repeatedly zaps enemies that go inside. Aura damages... Orange damage penetrates enemy defense. Costs 10 Ethere Ethereum mana per use while defending an Eternia Crystal. Cannot be used without Eternia mana until the Eternia Crystal has been defended. Oh, we have to actually do a successful event for me to use this thing, I think. Yep. I'm gonna quickly get the Shimmer over. Oh, right, right. I need to go to the Shimmer. Actually, do you think you'll be- I'm gonna be moving some think... of it over to our base. Yeah, do you think you'll be done with that by the time I, uh, go to the dungeon? Uh, I doubt. I don't think I have enough wood needs to actually move it over. Oh. Well, I'm gonna go to the dungeon first anyways, because I want to use that key. Okay, I'll put this- st this staff away for now. I'll just put it in my Don't chest. accidentally piss off the cultist. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I won't have my weapon selected then. So it's, fin it's finally good to have max health. <laughs> so yeah, apparently 500 is the max. And who knows, that extra 5 health may come in handy. Maybe, I don't know. Yeah. God damn, why are there so many grave gravestones here, man? What the hell?
hitbox for the drill has always been really weird to me. Alright, let's get rid of these damn tombstones. We don't need this crap. Okay. Oh, yeah, ignore the cultists. <laughs> I'll deal with them later. Oh, fuck. Okay. My, yep. My goal is going there to be uh, to fi figure out what the hollowed chest even looks like, because I don't even know what it looks like. All I know is I need it <laughs> for something. Oh, hey, I, I got my Morning Star back. Hmm. It's cool. And then I just placed more wires. It's nice to still have that. When the hell did this weird mace thing get here? I don't remember that being here. I forgot I can dig in here. Alright, so let's find out what a hollow chest looks like. And, uh... As it turns out, the dungeon is still incredibly dangerous. What is this part of the dungeon? Oh, this isn't part of the dungeon. Thought okay. I might not be able to get the shimmer to our base, but I might be able to move it to uh, one of to the jungle house. Mhm. Mm or not. That works too. Actually, I, I really, let me try and look up what the hollow chest looks like, if that's even on the wiki. It should be. No way, bad. I'm, I'm busy. I'm busy looking up shit. No. Forcing me to drink a hollowed potion. Hollowed chest. Good, it is on the page. Biome chests. Um, that's not a, I don't think that's a biome chest. Let's see, um, hollow chest. The hollow chest is like blue, I think. I think we saw that, uh, chest. Yeah. I don't know, I'll, I'll know it, I'll know if it's like, if it's open already. I, I don't remember if, I don't know if we've gotten every single chest in here already. I don't think we did. Uh, that is a normal chest. I mean, ideally, I feel like I should get rid of the chests that are already been opened. Don't mind me, just gonna dig and cheat. I'm just gonna cheat real quick. Ooh! I can I can steal those wires. Oh hey, more I'm exploring the jungle and other stuff so I can find some loose uh, wires so I can steal that. That's good. Okay, well, we've gotten this chest already. Oh, but you can't get rid of, like, a chest. Fuck off. You just have to, you just kind of have to remember which ones you've gotten already. More ectoplasms, I can't complain about that. Out of mana. Rip. Hello, ectoplasm. You want to give yourself up to me? Oh yeah, a blood moon. Hooray! I have been here already. Hmm. 
This is not part of the uh, this is not part of the dungeon. Well, I'm gonna head to the uh, lizard temple to try and break whatever wires I missed. Oh, interesting. Uh, this is bad news, Betsy, right here. Or archery potions. <laughs> Shameful Muramasa that I don't need. Um, what's this? What's this chest? This one has recall potions and arrows. So we've opened this chest already. I don't know which one that is, but it's red. This one, we have, nope. This one we can't open. We need the ice key. So that's something we need to find still. Wait a minute. Did that fucking skull just drop cream soda? <laughs> that's an amazing drop. Yeah. Skeleton thinks he's funny. Dropping cream soda. a Funi skeleton. Alright, what else are we have in here? God damn it, cursed skull. I can't even get on my mount. Oh, weird specter guy. That's another chest we have already. And apparently you died. To a flying snake. <laughs> Great. And there is nothing of interest down here. I do not want what you're selling. Why do you have a gun, sir? <laughs> uh, and this isn't part of the dungeon. Okay. Why is the water all red now? Ah, uh, Blood Moon. Oh. <laughs> I was wondering why. Oh. Remember when Blood Moons were actually scary? I mean, apparently there's an actual mini boss we can apparently fight when fishing during a blood moon. Wow. It's news to me. I want to see if I can actually pull it up. It's a uh, very early one. That is pretty cool, though. It, that would be pretty cool if that was the case. Okay, and this is like the edge of the dungeon. Oh boy. Mm, I kind of want to go up here. I want to see what's over here. Uh, the blue dungeon vase. Like two different ways to go here. There, what sort of chest is that? Well, let me check your screen. Um, I don't know what chest that is. Oh, I was signed out of Twitch. Don't oh. you love that? Well, it doesn't look like I can open it. Jesus Christ, I'm getting harassed. Hmm. I don't know, it's it's a red, it's a red chest with a blue lock. So honestly I have no idea. That's a crimson chest, is it? No. That can't be it. 
I need to see what the hollowed chest looks like. The problem is, is it's fucking inverted. Uh, the hollowed chest is blue with like an orange lock. Okay, so I need to find a blue chest somewhere. Okay. Well then, what's what's that chest that I just found? That is not a. That is a. Wait, what is that? Hang on, let me let me look let me look at that again. That is a desert chest, I think. I think there was a desert key in the chat. At home. Um. Or it's a jungle chest. I'm not sure. They both look pretty red to me, so I gotta look out. I gotta look for a blue chest. That'll be. I'm key. tempted to do something stupid. Wait, is that it? Is that it right there? Oh, yes, it is. I found it. It has the rainbow gun in inside. Can you fucking stop? Fuck off. I'm trying to loot this chest, bro. The fuck you mean it's... Oh, not open. What do you mean? God, I hate this place sometimes. I dropped a lance. Do I have to actually... Oh, let me... I have to mi mine the obsidian. What else is in here? Coin, spelunker potion, platinum bars. So, let me look at the rainbow gun. <laughs> 33 magic damage. Well, I'll have to test it out. And see how it how it does. So, I think that's all I came in okay. here. I don't... I, there can't be multiple chests, right? I don't think so. I don't think there can be. I could be 100% wrong. I mean, I'll look. Let me see. Let's see. Biome chests are hard mode chests found within the dungeon. Each one contains one specific rare powerful weapon. Um, only five biome chests, one of each type, will spawn. Okay, thanks, Terraria. Well, there's your answer. So I want to test out this rainbow gun. Um, we'll see. Was... I think I gotta go to the Tinkerer first. And then actually make the rainbow gun good. Okay. Wow, the mushroom biome looks pretty dope when the blood moon's active. There's the tinkerer. Alright. Um yeah, so let me put the rainbow gun in there. Ah oh, fucking hell! I can't even tinker shit. Christ on a tricycle. <laughs> That's a new one. Alright, let me go back there. Oh, sorry. I'm mining the obsidian. Sorry about the uh, the tombstone in your house, Tinker. All good, all good. Oh, you you weren't talking to me <laughs> about that. Okay. I was yeah, I was talking to the Tinker. <laughs> he has a, he, I died in his house, now he has a tombstone in there. Bro, we need someone. It has an aesthetic, and it also... Probably, I don't know. Adds that macabre vibe. Uh, oh, okay. It works. You found you found them. I accidentally triggered an attorney thing. Demonic. Shawnee. Well, I was testing to see if I could get it to work. Can't have shit in Detroit, man. I'm dying. I think I made the rainbow gun better. So where are these enemies at? 
Over at our attorney a thing. Oh, okay. Oh, look at that. Oh wow, that's really good. <laughs> Gee. Wait, how far does it go? That's not bad, honestly. Quickly dealing with the thing. This is actually a fine ass weapon. Here, and I and I, I could probably stack this with the um with the shadow beam staff too. So yeah, the ra <laughs> the rainbow gun is actually really good. You could just have a freaking rainbow that does damage yeah. as long as the enemies touch it. I, mean, I don't have to worry too much about the right side of the screen. If I'm not or mistaken, you can rather. summon your uh, thing with the cane. Oh yeah, let me try that out. I think I have it in my Oh chest. yeah, you also have summon. Mm, where did I put it? Oh yeah, sure enough. Look at all these, look at all these, uh, look at all these summons I have now. <laughs> yeah. I don't need to worry about it. I don't even need to worry for a while. Man, going to going to get that rainbow gun was like one of the best things I ever did this episode. Like, it's actually working. Oh, uh, but it does it does run out after a while, so I have to refresh it after a while. Yeah, I'm gonna put it over here. Actually, never mind. I think I has. To, I think it has to delete itself before. Oh no, the wyverns are back. Damn. Oh yeah, your deadly spear staff. No. Well, we lost. <laughs> By the way, you have summons. Just wanted to make you aware. What do you mean I have summons? Like your uh, summon staff? Stabs and stuff? Mm. I oh, do to... not have that anymore. I have it. I'm just, I just need to clean up my inventory. Five ectoplasms, huh? Time to move the shimmer. Dungeon spirit. Oh yeah, the cream soda. <laughs> so block. Okay, I don't need any of this stuff. Uh, how much shimmer do you think we need? I have no idea. <laughs> the demonic key blade. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> yeah, monkey noises. Lucky Tabby allows the ability to dash. <laughs> Interesting. Probably won't use that though. Yeah. The Keen Shadow Jousling Lance. What does that do again? Oh yeah, that thing. Yeah, I didn't really, I don't really like this weapon much. <laughs> and then I get more the wires. I don't need pixie dust. The Adept Rainbow Gun. Hmm. I want to see if I can buff my 
I want to see if I can buff my weapon anymore. And then I go to that so I can... Then... Does it go beyond 33 damage? 39 damage? Ooh, okay. The mythical rainbow gun. Go okay. to my oh. rift in space so I can grab my grand design. Murderous shadow beam staff. So hang on, I'm, I'm kind of uh, trying to understand. When you uh, when you tinker stuff, is the ones with red text like really good? I don't know. That's what I'm seeming to understand. Because I have yeah. um, my shadow beam staff and mythical rainbow gun are like red, and they they have like it has like three to five different buffs. Meanwhile, um, for example, the ruthless morning star is blue. And it has one buff and one like negative side effect. So here's what I might try. I think purple is also a good, uh, good text thing. I have not seen purple. So uh, it's for magic weapons. Oh, the godly, so de weapon. the godly deadly sphere staff. Can I tinker the? Can I tinker this? The lightning hurricane. The keen lightning hurricane. Well, I got purple, like you said. This one has 3% crit damage. Yeah. So now I have the godly sphere staff. How much money did I spend on that though, I wonder? I don't know. Mummy shirt? <laughs> No, I don't want that. I'm gonna sell that. And also, the gothic chair. Gothic chair? Yeah, gothic chair. <laughs> Not really in the mood for gothic stuff right now, though. I'm gonna go to the shimmer just right now, because I don't know when we're gonna have a. Like a reliable source where of it. Is all, where did the wire cut off? Angry Nimbus. That was an enemy I haven't seen much. Oh god, the dirt blank. Where did the wire cut off? Over here. Okay. I love how most of these Terraria episodes just devolve into like a crap ton of preparation with. Half the time, no payoffs at all. <laughs> well, we'll have Shimmer. Uh, I mean, that's that's definitely uh, a payoff. In an easier to access spot. Yeah, instead of having to go halfway across the map for it. Oh, I see the I see the random part of corruption now. Yep. How different is a playthrough with the Crimson instead? Uh, you'll get a, uh, you'll get a lot of crimson enemies, and, uh, instead of random holes, uh, it's a big fucking cave. Oh, I don't know. That's, that sounds annoying. <laughs> like, for the random holes that you have to go through to explore the underground corruption? Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's a big fucking cave. I mean, it sounds annoying, but I actually don't think that's that bad. Although there are a fuck ton of spiders. Crep oh. Or crimson spiders. Oops, I went too far across the map, and now I'm <laughs> at the edge Spooters. of the map. Yeah, Spooter. Spooter man. Okay. This is the Shimmer Cave, I think. Right? That is not the Shimmer. That is not the Shimmer drop. Okay. I went past it somehow. Is this it right here? And then nope. I just place... Is this it? Nope. We should we should have a sign. Oh, I'm stupid. There's the, the frickin' wire going down there. There we go, and then I just place the... Outlet pump right here. 
Well, I mean, at least you're better with the wires than I am. Fuck. No, I do not want to deal with zombies right now. Okay. Let's, let's find out what happens if I throw the life fruit in there. Ye okay, now I need a switch. This gives me... Gives me the Aegis fruit. I have not... I have not seen this before. Consumable permanently increases defense. Oh, shit. Oh, nice. Shit, I might have to get you one of these. Well, the question is, how much defense does it actually give you? <laughs> Don't know. Uh, you can check in your... Uh, there should be uh, the shield in your, like, your armor slot bullshit. Mm, the shield... There's a shield logo. 46 defense. Hmm, I don't know how, I don't know, I'll, I'll see. The Aegis Fruit is a hard mode permanent booster item. It increases the defense by four. I mean, it's not that bad. I mean, four defense is, is good. And now we will have Shimmer. In the jungle. I might have to get you. I might have to get you an Aegis heart then. Ye. Which means back to the jungle. Ye. Oh, we have Shimmer. Okay, that's good actually. That means I won't have to backtrack there. I only have to get you a life fruit and then I'll be done. Oh, it's too bad I didn't have an extra life fruit. That would have been nice. Right, which parts of the jungle have I not just... explored yet? This part. I'll move the outlet pump here. And then I just move the wire over here. That is... Cut the wire. Or as Dr. Robotnik says, cut the monitors. There we go. We now have a pool of shimmer. Yeah. Shimmer. In an easier to access place. Thank God. I'm just blowing up this entire jungle. <laughs> There's gonna be like no Should jungle I... left. Should I add more? Or add, make it so there's more shimmer? I mean, I only really need the bare minimum. I need to look up what a life fruit looks like, it so I know what to look out for. I keep forgetting what it looks yeah, like. Yeah, I place that there, that there, and then I place that there. Oh, well, it's a little vine that has a heart on it. That should be that should be pretty obvious, honestly. Fruit. There we go. I drained a lot of the shimmer pool, so we have a fuck ton of shimmer. Yeah. Just steal all that shimmer. There's a lot of angry vines here. I don't appreciate that. Then... Should I relocate the shimmer after? Mm, honestly, I have no idea. <laughs> What the fuck? What? <laughs> I have a cute little companion now. Oh, wonderful. What kind of companion? Uh, I don't know what the thing's called. It is called a glommer. <gasps> it's oh. fuzzy and slimy. Oh, great. I read the buff. I want to. I want to see. That's your, what the buff says. I want to see your little friend. It's a little bee. Ooh, a bee! I like bees. 
Wait a minute. I think I got rid of my app. Oh no, mildly inconvenient. Where did where did you put the shimmer? Uh, shimmer is over here. Check where I am on the map. Um, I'm moving it again. I mean, I can. I'm planning on moving it all the way to the uh. Um. Well, I see. To the jungle house. Well, I um. Where are you right now? <laughs> uh, I'm near the jungle house. Uh, just head towards the thing and you'll see a little ca artificial cave. Uh, head towards the shimmer. Head towards the head shimmer? Head in the direction of where the sh shimmer is. And you'll see it. Okay. It's the temporary spot. Mm. How will I know what the cave looks like? You'll see the shimmer. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I see it. Wow, kind of funny. You just got it all the way over here. Yep. Oh no, not more turtles. Come on, guys. Kill the turtle. Kill oh, him. yeah, I'm a turtle. Kill Fuck. him. Yeah, eat his fruit. Actually, yes. How much defense do you have right now? Uh, 49. 49? Oh, shit. This will give you 53, then. Yee. Wait, how do you have more? Nice. Wait, you have the, uh, you have the Spectre helmet? I have the full Spectre set. I'm asking if you have the helmet or the hood, though, because the hood has less defense. I have the mask. The mask. Okay, yeah, that's why you have more defense, then. Okay, um, now where are you at? Are you at the shimmer still? I'm underneath the jungle house, and I'm currently. Okay. Um. All right. Let's let's stand in the house. Yeah. And I will give you your Aegis fruit. So now we have another okay. permanent. We have another permanent booster. I'm looking at the wiki uh, and seeing what if there's any more of those we can get. Nom. Fifty-three. I'm, I'm dipping. I mean, yeah, going. A four, four defense increase is actually really good. Um, <laughs> Torch God's favor. And then I just vital crystal. I think I've already used the vital crystal. Yeah, throwing. Cut this wire. Okay. Cut that wire. Cut that wire. Fuck. Art. Um, Ambrosia permanently increases the character's mining tile and wall speed by 5%. What the fuck? How do you get Something, that? I think my money got transmuted. Oh no. Oh, that's what you're talking about. Throwing any kind of fruit into Shimmer. Yep, Ambrosia. Okay. Um. Oh, there's a dragon fruit. We can make an, we can make an Ambrosia. In the hmm. chest. I think okay. I think yeah. That's all of the uh, good upgrades. I on. need another inlet pump. Ah, two inlet pumps, one outlet pump. There we go, and then I head there. Do you have any moon knees? Uh, any moon knee? Yeah, because I'm trying to uh, create this whole uh, thing of a who's it. Um, I'll see how much I have. Uh, I can sell some excess junk, which I'm probably gonna do. Okay, how much money do you need? Uh, I think it... I think about a gold's worth, but... I can quickly confirm that. Yeah, because I don't want to pull out money and then realize I don't have enough. Yeah, that... Okay, give me a singular second. Uh... 
best I can do is give you five gold. <laughs> yeah, that definitely should be enough. Yeah, because I have lots of gold. I have, a, I have an entire platinum in this chest. <laughs> yep, that is definitely enough. And I'll give you whatever else, whatever uh, I don't end up using. Sure. Also, I found out something interesting on the wiki. It says mm -hmm. it says you can only get spelunker glow sticks on full moons. Okay, so we we look at the moon, I guess. Yeah. Is that the only way? Is that the only way to tell like what time what, what yeah. the moon is? Yeah. How do I even check? We look the, at the moon. How do I even check the moon? Uh, look at the background. Um, I don't see a moon out yet. <laughs> Yeah, I don't see the moon. Is it even nighttime yet? I think it is. Oh, I assume it, it is. Yes, this is 3 a.m. Can I not see the moon in the hollow? Maybe the moon doesn't show up in the hollow. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Might have to go to a different biome to even see the moon. Okay. Uh, I don't see the moon at all. <laughs> That's weird. Well, hang on. Let me let me look at the wiki a bit more. Full moon. Apparently, it's a new moon. Let's see. Neat. It takes eight in-game cycles for the moon to move through all phases. So we need to we need to wait four in-game days for a full moon if we want to get splurred right. glow sticks. Oh, uh, so there that. is a way to speed up time. Uh, we need a we need another bed. Another bed? Oh, we need to both yeah. sleep in a bed. I think I think that's the case. Hmm. And if not, uh, I will happily eat my words. I don't even know if we have a second bed. Sitting around somewhere. Wait, unless I have one. I think one there should be one in the chest after the pirate invasion. There is. Um, there's a gold. Uh, is time sofa. speeding up? Does time speed up when you're just sitting still? <laughs> I'm laying in the bed. Oh. Oh, I thought we had a golden chest. I don't think this one has anything. And if not, I can make a bed. Yeah, because <laughs> I don't think we have any beds on hand. You know, unless there's... Well, there's the vault. Bed. Well, there's nothing even in the vault. <laughs> bed. Uh, so we need silk. Which we have. We have. Yeah, I don't have any beds. <laughs> okay, uh, we ha we have silk, and you know what? For this, uh, where is the ice? Where's the party girl? Because I think we have the party girl. Party girl. I don't know what the party girl looks like. Is that the party girl? No, that's the hairstylist. Alright, let me sell all this crap that I don't need. Demon Eye Banner? I don't need that shit. Um, hmm. Oh yeah, I forgot. Uh, I need to get some more of the wires, which I do have the moon knee from you. Yes, the moon knee. Okay. And then I get the wires. Why are you doing that? <laughs> uh, so that I c we can have access to shit on the shimmer. Oh yeah. Easy shimmer. And then we just pop that there. Good question: and... Have you have you used an arcane crystal already? I believe, but uh. I mean, there's one in. We the can chest. always make another one if that isn't the case. 
Well, no, there's, there's, no, there, there's a spare oh. one in the chest at home. That's why I was wondering, because I have I have it, okay. but you can only use one per person. Okay. Well, I'm going to be a little bit uh, conservative on wires, because I don't have enough. Damn. Fuck! And the tortoise got you again. <laughs> Fucking tortoises. Goddamn tortoises. Get off my ass, tortoise. <laughs> yeah, the tortoises are annoying. What the hell is Spelunker Flare? Uh, flares, uh, if we get out, if we found one, uh, we could use that. We could get a flare gun and shoot basically Splunker's glow sticks. That can actually do damage. Interesting. <laughs> that, seems that seems weird. I think I'd rather just keep the Splunker glow stick. It's basically the same thing, it's just it does damage. Mm-hmm. There's a weapon called- there's a- there's a piece of- there's an item called the Magic Lantern. It's a light pet summoning item that spawns a small glowing Magic Lantern. Interesting. Oh, but you- but you also- you also have to buy that from the Skeleton Merchant. That's during a full moon. God, this wire bullshit is expensive. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm kind of bored now. I don't really know what to do. <laughs> I mean, we can deal with the cultist? I think now would be a good time to deal with the cultist. Actually... After I use the bathroom, then we can deal with the cultists. Okay, I we will have shimmer by then. That's good. Easy access shimmer. Should be good now. Oh, I see your little fuzzy friend now. He's like a, uh... I don't know. I don't know what he's supposed to be, actually. Kinda oh, looks like a little fly buddy or something. I have, I have two summons. Yeah, I do. Okay. Why is there Moony inside this house? There's just randomly some pixie dust in there. Did you did you mute yourself? Oh, I I did. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good thing I brought it up. Then. I accidentally did. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm pretty much ready. I'm just quickly finishing up that uh, shimmer thing because I was trying to get some wires. Scrounging for money to get wires. Wires are expensive. 
Surprisingly, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Ectoplasms. Do you have the armor? What, you mean? Your armor upgrade? Are you talking about the, uh, the Spectre helmet? Yeah. Do you have your Spectre set? I have a full Spectre set. I was just wondering if I should make a Spectre helmet or not. But I think I'm fine with the Spectre hood. Because it has that lifesteal effect. And your Spectre, ah. your Spectre mask has a different bonus effect. So we get like two different bonus effects to happen at once. Yeah. Which I okay, quite like. Now I just place a inlet pump in here, over here, and then I just connect this with wire over here. And then that there, and start draining the shimmer. Cream soda. Let's see. Um. Uh, can you check the uh thing? What thing? Uh, the brain is not working on words. Uh, I can check that. I can check the thing. Yeah, I don't know. God, I, don't, I, don't know what I am forgetting words. Don't mind me. <laughs> I'm forgetting words. What is the plenty okay, satisfied so I have to effect? That there. Well, I can. This is gonna be a waste, a bit of a wasteful process, but. Let's see. Um... Wait, why is this not draining? Why is this not draining you? What? What? What the fuck? Okay. Okay. Why are you not working? Do I have the wrong? I have an in. I have two inlet pumps. That's why you aren't draining. Okay. Ooh. That explains. Okay. I, f I, f I, lo I looked up another thing. You know how, like, you get a bunch of those random funny items that say, like, m you know, m improvement to all your stats or whatever? Ye. I wanted to look up just how much it actually does. And for example, I have a cream soda which does a medium improvement to all stats. And apparently, this medium improvement gives you plus 3 defense and plus 7.5% damage. <laughs> Ooh. And you also get 30% movement speed, too. Nice. So that is really nice. Uh, f let's see. Food items that provide major improvements to all stats. Um, let's see. Burgers, <laughs> drops from Chimeras, and Eaters of Souls are the easiest ones to obtain. Yep. Interesting. Well, Crimera is the, uh... Crimson equivalent to the Eater of Souls, okay. Yep. So if I really want, I could grind Eaters of Souls and get a bunch of burger get a bunch of hamburgers. <laughs> yep. Now that is a funny idea. And I can play some platforms so that we can now always have access to Shimmer. Hmm. Yeah, always having access to Shimmer is nice. Well, guess I'm going to the Corruption then, and we're <laughs> gonna see if I can find some Eaters of Souls and get hamburgers. That is just very humorous, honestly. Gee. I'm gonna just drill that, and outlet pump. Why are you not draining? Oh, hey, there he is. Thing is, I don't know what the drop rate for a hamburger is. Am I out? Is it out of shimmer? Is the second reservoir? Hmm. The second source of shimmer, is it drained? Okay. No, it isn't. Oh, 
Oh. They have a 1% chance to drop burgers. Oh, that is that, annoying. That is not very common at all. That's not really cash money. Yeah, it wasn't very cash God, money. God, that sounded so cringe. It just reminds me of my time on Amino and when people used to say that. <laughs> they just say that wasn't very cash money of you, bro. Yeah. There's the meteor that's still there for some reason. Oh, okay. I left the, uh. I left the corruption. I mean, I could just stand still and I'll have, um, you know, the Eaters of Souls come to me. That seems to be like one of the easiest ways to do it. But I also have to deal with the problem of there just being a bunch of random, like, slime instead. No hamburgers. Sad. I mean, that is a 1% chance. That is a very low opportunity. And now... I think I've managed to drain basically all, well, not all, but most of the shimmer. I'm making good progress there. God, I wish I could just set up an auto clicker for that just so I can just click the drain thing. <laughs> uh, I guess I should be glad I don't know the struggles. Yep. Okay, this is boring. I'm gonna go somewhere else. Instead of trying to sit around and hope for a fucking hamburger drop from a Eater of Souls. <laughs> I'm happy with my cream soda that I have. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Well, there is one thing I'm curious. I forget if I put any heart regeneration lamp lanterns where the cultist is at. Because I don't think I did. And I think having those there would actually make the boss a little easier. Just a tad. Now we will have, I think, all of the shimmer. <laughs> I think I, I think by the end of this episode, we'll have uh, emptied the entire shimmer. That you're just gonna have the entire thing empty. Wait a minute, hang on a second. Oh no wonder. I'm stupid. So I was killing Wait, what? I was killing corruptors. Why was the shimmer cloak not why was it phasing why did it phase me? Hmm, weird. When did it phase me? Yeah, there there is no heart lantern here. I have my shimmer cloak. Fun. Why are you phasing me? That's weird, even though you have it on. I shouldn't phase. Where did I where did I put my extra heart lanterns? Hmm. I know I put them somewhere. Did I put them in here? I could have sworn I had some extra ones. Mm. There we go. They might be in my my chest. Oh shit! We have a shimmer leak. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we have any. Um, I don't think we have any Oops. arc crystals left. Or what? Are we they? have a shimmer leak. <laughs> the shimmer leak. I'm gonna take this heart lantern and put it somewhere else. 
That's a minor oops. If I put this heart lantern over where the dungeon is, then, uh... Might make that boss a little easier. Do we have a teleport teleporter set up for the, um... For getting over to the cultist? Yeah. Should have been using that this whole time. <laughs> uh, it should take you straight to the dungeon. Yeah, that's what I want. That is not the right... Why does it take me to the- why does it take me to hell? <laughs> is there a different teleporter? Uh, yeah. There's a different teleporter. Where's that one at? Uh, it should be, it be the one? yellow one. Oh, I found it. Okay, well, I'm glad to have that now. Alright, so let's put the heart lantern right here. There we go. Well, we have all the shimmer, I think. All the shimmer. Yeah, so now now the heart now the heart crystal will kick in. There's only two cultists. Fucking moth. Hmm, <laughs> moth. A moth was in my face. <laughs> it was, well, it was trying to fly into my face. Damn you, Moth. Moth, man. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit, this looks sick. Yeah, that is... I think I've managed to empty the Shimmer Lake. Bet these guys will be pleased to know they have a frickin' Shimmer pool outside their house. <laughs> yep, and where's the platform? Because I'm going to try and make it so it's safe for you to not accidentally phase. Yeah. There has to be like a documented list of everything you can throw into the shimmer. Oh, now I don't phase. Okay. Weird. Yeah, yeah, I might, I might do that. I might look up what we, what you can throw in the shimmer. I am mildly curious to see what happens if I do this. Whoops. I'm doing something. I'm doing a bit of remodeling. You're getting a. Let's see. I need some rich mahogany, so I can get some rich mahogany platforms. There we go, and... There's the Rod of Harmony. That's a post-Moon Lord tool. Oh, well, not gonna get that then. Um... The Contaminator can be used to create or destroy biomes. Yep. And if you throw the Contaminator into the, the Shimmer, it turns into the Terraformer. <laughs> yep. Hmm. Interesting. They have all the Shimmer in... They have all the Shimmer under their house. Have you thrown a Star Cloak into the Shimmer? Star Cloak? I don't mm -hmm. think so. Why do you ask? Uh, it gives you something. Oh, I have not yet. Yeah, you should you should try it. I will do that once I uh, commit okay. some vandalism. <laughs> All right. There we go. Uh, do I actually have a star cloak on? No. Oh well. <laughs> But I do have a kite. I don't know if a kite can be thrown in there. <laughs> Let's see. I'm... Oh, 
The Lightning. Well, hang on, let me see. The Can Lightning Aura Can can be turned into the Flame Burst Can. Is that better? I still phase somehow. Weird. Oh, the failings are here now. Hmm. There's the necro helmet. That's not. Is that any good? I don't think so. The power of excess shimmer. <laughs> yep. Wait, what the fuck? This might be the weirdest one yet. If you throw a corruption key into the shimmer, it turns into a corruption chest. <laughs> oh, neat. Why would you ever want that? Uh, for decorative, I guess. Yeah, I guess. Oh, the, the, this is a very extensive list, damn. The discount card turns into the lucky coin. Okay. Oh, this is kind of cool, actually. If oh, you... fuck. Uh, I am phasing... somehow. <laughs> somehow. Now, let me try this. So if I throw the discount card into the shimmer, it turns into the lucky coin. I am immune to phasing. What do you mean I phase? And if you equip the lucky coin, hitting enemies will sometimes drop extra coins. <laughs> That's I kind might of be trying to drain the entire shimmer. <laughs> Well, what happens if I throw the coin back in? Does it turn back into the card? Wait, what? Now it turns into the gold ring. Increases coin pickup range. Oh man, I just lost my freaking discount card then. <laughs> well. Oh well. Okay, and then... Oh wait, no, it turned back into it. What the fuck? That's weird. That is really weird. This is going to look like an eyesore. But I'm trying to contain all of the shimmer. All the shimmer. Okay, this is just kind of a funny one. If you throw cactuses into the shimmer, they turn into pumpkins. Oh! So... That is so convenient. Good, a good way to get, uh, a good way to get pumpkins, I guess. Do we have a Sparkle Slime Balloon? I don't think so. Apparently that's a drop from the Queen Slime. Hmm. What the fuck is happening here? <laughs> okay, oh. I think I've drained the entire Shimmer. It sure looks that way. I have Dragon Fruit. Oh, hang on a minute. Maybe I could throw that into the shimmer. Should we? Now the question is, do we keep it here or do we move it? I think it's fine in the jungle. It's not that hard to get over there. Oh, fuck. Okay, so if I throw the dragon fruit into the shimmer, I can get ambrosia. I really need to know if we have this slime balloon thing. Am 
Golden candle. I don't think we do. I really need to, uh... Well, our... Well, the shimmer is empty. No, not the shimmer. Original shimmer is empty. Oh, you mean that shimmer. <laughs> yeah, the original. Sorry that I haven't sold is... the godly adamant type. Our pool really will now be in the jungle. The... I see that as a win-win, honestly. All right, let me go to the. Sh yep. Let me go back to the shimmer. We now now never have to go to the old shimmer again. Um, there's a problem. What's wrong? You putting all that shimmer, uh, broke the pylon. Oh. Oh. Does it not count as a jungle biome anymore? Apparently not. It says there are not enough villagers near there, which is weird. Wait, wait a minute. I think I found the issue. That is a very odd problem. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I, I accidentally de unhoused someone. Oh, you might have. I mean, there's a door missing here. Is that is that why? No. I, mean, honestly, I... I don't know. What the fuck? You are in this house. What do you mean, good sir? I want to try. Th I want to throw some stuff in here, like the pixie dust and the gel. And the dragon fruit. I think I broke this guy. Oh no. Oh, there it is. There it is. Give me that. Ambrosia is. It might be useful. <laughs> and apparently, throwing this in changes it as well. Ooh. I can shimmer him. Ooh, flame burst cane. Hold holy, on. Holy shit. 46 damage. That definitely seems like an upgrade. Well, I'm gonna go back. I'm going to. to I am going to modify the house. Don't mind me. All right. Hopefully, it fixes it. Yep. Love how we've made a new problem. <laughs> it's a housing issue now. Yeah, housing issues in Terraria is like one of the worst things. The most real thing possible. Yep. And I keep forgetting this guy is Cause I had, weird. Because this guy shimmered for a bit. Had a kind of a shimmer identity crisis for a minute. Okay, so where's the... Where's the lightning aura staff? Cane, yeah. The lightning aura cane only does 12 yeah, summon damage. He is shimmered. I bought the flame burst staff, I think. Oh yeah. Oh the flame burst can't yeah, I got that's a really good increase in damage. Stop shimmering, good sir. <laughs> the lizard guy. Okay, it says... Uh, the lizard guy is no longer a lizard right now. <laughs> He's no longer a lizard. The... By the way, if you didn't know, the voodoo guy was a lizard. Like, the <laughs> ones in the temple. Yeah, I did not know that. He is... He isn't now. What the, the fuck? How is there another door? <laughs> I 
<laughs> Days without scuff. Zero. <laughs> Hold up a minute. Some of this, some of this armor that this guy has, I forgot his name, the defender guy. Some of his armor seems, it sounds kind of nice actually. Oh wait, I might have made him, I think I might have made him female. I don't know. <laughs> well, that's one thing. I I have to I have to rebuild the house. Uh fuck. Yeah, that's that's pretty bad. Technical difficulties. Uh Ooh, uh, this is now your house. You should- this should all be fixed. There we go! Hmm. Okay, I'm looking at the- I'm looking at the wiki. And there, there's the Shinobi Infiltrator armor. Which apparently increases max number of sentries. And it also gives well, yeah, some- yeah, you can shimmer, uh... You can apparently shimmer villagers. Nice. That's confirmed with this guy. The witch it... doctor constantly stepping in and out of the shimmer. That is really weird. Let me compare this I don't to know the Spectre it... set. I don't know what happened. It... For all I know, it could just be making him human. And lizard. What the fuck does it do, actually? I need to look this up. Hmm. We'll see, we'll see, did we fix it yet? Okay, yep. we, fi we fixed the housing at least. Now we have some weird shit going on with the shimmer here. Yep. I fixed it. Oh crap. I'm sinking. Alright. Maybe now we can fight the, uh, the cultists? Yep. Alright, great. Well, I, actually, I can teleport straight there, then. Okay. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna drink my, I, drink my cream I set soda. up the teleporter, and I forget that that was a thing. I, I didn't even realize you made a teleporter <laughs> until... I asked. Alright, let me get let me get a rainbow gun ready. Alright. Where you at, cultist? Where, Where are them cultists at? Bro, I hate that he randomly just doesn't spawn. Doesn't make any sense. Don't you just love this stuff? Yeah, why does he only show up like some of the time? Uh, we have to kill all four of the cultists, which, uh, my guess is one of them somehow got into the, uh, junk, into the temple. I mean, it's possible. Into the dungeon. Hmm. I'm gonna quickly organize my inventory. Uh, let me know if uh, you somehow got him to spawn. I'm gonna head back to the base to sort my inventory. Yeah, fair enough. I think mine's already. Oh, mine is not sorted. Hmm. Yeah, well, I don't need the flame burst cane right now or these torches. Why is there a loom in my inventory? A loom? A loom. Why is there a loom? 
Mm, that is a good question. I don't know, I see any cultists in here. I mean, we can always spawn a bed and try and force them to show up. Yeah, that force way. them to show up. Because we can force time skips. Yeah. Why just end that? I'm just gonna go back to base. So I guess, uh, sleeping in bed? Yep. Because I do not see him here. Of course, him to show up. Yep. Alright. We is, need cloth. The question is, where will we put this extra bed? When it, when in doubt, in the rain. I'm gonna put the bed in the rain. I mean, there's potentially a, there's potentially some spot upstairs. Yeah. Where's the silk? I don't know if we have any. I think I have some, because I tend to, without thinking, somewhat uh, hoard random items. Well, so let's see if I have some... I have a blue sofa! A oh, blue sofa? A blue sofa. Yeah, I kinda wish I had an extra bed. Uh, do we have any cobwebs then? Uh, nope. No. I, I usually get rid of all my cobwebs, because I never think they're necessary. Oh, I have cobwebs. Okay. Well, good, to know, good, good, to good, good to know that I should keep my cobwebs. Uh... We have silk. Uh, okay. A silk. So there's a there's a demon eye randomly. Okay. I don't see no cultists. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. I ain't afraid of no cultists. <laughs> I ain't afraid of no cultists. You know, yeah. I will, um... I will break some of this... I'm gonna break some of this dungeon. Why in the hell not? Okay. Uh, how do you? Is there a way to shimmer some silk? Shimmer some silk. I might be feeling lazy in that regard. Do the I'm feeling do, lazy. Do, do the necromancer banners need to be here? Don't think so. I'll put them down just in case. I'm just like. Bring up. I'm, I'm making some like. I'm we put... need anywhere between two silk and five. Hmm. Wonder if cobwebs can show up in the dungeon. How do you get cobwebs? Yeah, look at all those eyes I just killed. But it won't. I wonder if there's anything else I can do with the rainbow gun. Okay, I guess I'm heading into the uh, underground. <laughs> all right. The rainbow gun has 45 damage normally. Oh, I need to get rid of this uh, uh, grand design because this UI thing is getting annoying. Oh, okay. The best. I'd rather not see the wires than the uh, best modifier the... for the rainbow gun is ruthless. The mythical modifier provides the wildest array of stat bonuses, but the only stats that improve damage output uh, are damage and crit chance. Do you perchance have a pound hammer? Oh wait, I have cobwebs. There's there's a pound hammer in the chest at home. Yeah. The reason why I was asking is because I was 
down below. And I, I think I have enough for us mm. to make a bed. I think I'll stick with the mystical rainbow gun. Okay, so we can actually now uh, make whatever bed we want. Hooray! You're not the cultists. Oh, well, I want so, you. To what kind of bed do I feel like building? Oh! Apparently in the 3DS version, you can actually make a Lynx outfit. Oh wow, that's one cool thing about the 3DS version, I guess. Uh, let's see... Is there an alien bed? Right of all this crap. I don't need all this shit. I'll buy blue bricks. Okay, I can make a crystal bed. Uh, or not. Where's the crystal? Cultists, are oh, you back I have yet? the crystal. Oh, they're not back still. I don't really know how to get them to you show up. You can make up. a spooky bed. I, mean, I don't really care what bed, I just want a nice looking bed. And then we can just force speed up time. Hmm, actually what? Well, it's Blood Moon right now, so I can't really tell what moon it is. Oh, why is there a loom in here? A loom? There we go. Oh, okay. Yep. Uh, click the top of it, near the pillow side. Th there we go. It should speed up time. 2 a.m. Hey, it's working. Alright. You see the visual? Of the clouds moving quickly? Oh yeah, I see. 3 a.m. That's kinda cool. A little bit slow, though. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out how to get the cultists to respawn. Like, how, what, how much time has to pass? the lunatic cultist. Um, let me see. I think it tells you. I think we should be able to check now. All four cultists respawn after 12 in-game hours, so we need to go there at, like, 4 p.m., I think. Wow, you dug a thing in the roof. Yep, that might help, I don't know. <laughs> they have not spawned, so I guess. I guess we'll wait till 4 p.m., then. Yep. It's time to go back to sleep. Exactly. Oh, and a traveling merchant has arrived. Ooh. I'm gonna check him out. Where is he? Where is he? Oh. Are you able to Looks check like they that? took a dip in the shimmer.
I don't know if he has anything good. Stopwatch displays how fast the player is moving. Oh yeah, we forgot to join team. Uh, I mean, I did. Oh, I, I didn't remember. Oh, and my, uh, I unset my spawn point by accident. Wee! Gotta love scuff. <laughs> Look at all these paintings get here. I don't remember putting all these paintings down. There, I gotta... So there's another painting I'm gonna put down here in the house, I think. Yep, there we go. It's like it's like a bunch of boonies. Yeah, boonies. More, uh... I mean, more decoration for the house is always nice. It could oh, be, yeah. Honestly, I think it could be fun, like, to go back and look at each episode and just see how the house improved. Yeah. It's like, here, here's, uh, here's our house in episode one. And then here's our house in episode 20. Wait, it's been 20 episodes? God damn. Um, I don't think it's been 20. It's been close, though. Let me double check. Um, this is episode 19, so we're getting pretty close to 20. Oh, who the fuck is calling me? I'm just... Yeah, call it 12 in the morning. Actually, it's one. It's one in the morning for me, but yeah. Okay, it's ten a.m. Who knows if the cultists have respawned yet? I forgot where I got these rainbow bricks at. <laughs> hmm. I added another banner to our. Uh... Is it list our, of banner things. Our, our unnecessary banner collection. Yep, we now have jungle slimes. Wow. I usually get rid of all the banners, because most of them are repeats, and well, half of them aren't even that interesting. Yeah. I mean, hey, maybe I can start putting them up again. There's a lot of space in the basement for them. I remember just collecting just on one of my playthroughs, just an entire, like, hallway of just bloody well, um, every <laughs> buff. Yeah. The problem is... Every banner type. The problem is that they, like, don't reach out very far, <laughs> so most of them don't matter. Yeah. The cultists have not spawned in yet. I have no idea when they will. I only have two greater healing potions. I guess back the fuck to sleep, I guess? Back to sleep. Even though the clouds aren't really moving that fast. Okay. Well, I mean, it's supposed to speed up time. Yeah, it is. There we go. Okay. I don't know about how much it speeds up. Well, at least, like, double time. I know that. Oh, wow. Three. So, yeah, that's like 30 seconds, I think. There we go. The cultists have to be back by now. There's no way. They're not back. What the fuck? Let's close this door. <laughs> yeah, we don't want those damn cultists getting in the door. I don't know, maybe we're checking back on them too frequently. I don't know. Why do I want to fight those damn cultists, man? I mean, alternatively... Actually, I don't think we can fight Duke Fishron, right? We don't have any- we don't have that bait, do we? Yeah. So no. That's, so that's out of the question. 
Well, I suppose I, I mean, we can explore mushrooms. Yeah. Mushroom biome. Yeah, I was gonna say, I suppose I could just... Yeah, go to a mushroom biome. I think I... I think the nearest one is... Where's the nearest mushroom biome? I guess it'll be this one underground. Oh, yeah. I've been exploring the jungle biome so much that I almost never go down here anymore. This cave is very nostalgic, you know? Yeah. Yeah, if I just keep falling, I'll find the mushroom biome. And what, do we need like, don't we need like a I'm tempted net? to fight the golem for shits and giggles. Oh yeah, we haven't fought the golem in a while. Well, this is the crystal. To ease the monotony. Yeah. I don't know if you get anything good for defeating the golem a second time. I think we can get at least some stuff. I do have a net, so... If I found, um, if I found a truffle mushroom or whatever... What do we call it? Truffle worm? Oh, truffle worms? Yeah. Did you find any? Well, I'm, I'm looking. Hey, sweet. Oh, I found... Uh, do you have a bug net? Do you have a net? Yeah, I, I caught one. <laughs> I, the, the, the moment I bring it up, I find one. I might try. I might find, try and find a couple. Uh, no, we're not in the mushroom biome anymore. Hey, there's another one. There's two truffle worms now. Luminant bat. Oh my god, I forgot how annoying these fucking enemies are. Oh, there's a mimic. Ooh. Yeah, they're, they're, this this mimic's kind of going ape shit, and I'm dead. I got two. I got two truffle worms though. All right. Well, if the if the cultists aren't back still, let's try finding Duke Fishron again, maybe. Let's have a look. Mm, yeah, they're not back. Okay. Fuck! I almost got him. Oh, you almost killed the golem by yourself? <laughs> yep. Oh, great. Oh, well, hey, anyway, we could try and fight Duke Fishron then. Yeah. I think you can, we can get some cool shit from the golem, and then maybe Duke. Sure. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to modify the teleporter so that it will take us to Duke. I mean, how easy is it to do that? I just need to change out one little bit of wiring. Okay. It will. Mo I'll modify that teleporter so it'll take us to the uh, thing. Instead of Duke, or instead of the jungle temple. Or, I mean, not the jungle temple, the dungeon, I mean. Yeah. Well, I guess I'm going to the, I guess I'm going to the temple, the then. Yeah, I'm, getting to the temple is actually kind of easy. Take a dump. Do, 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 do. Oh, hello, armor skeleton. Fuck. There we go. Flying snake. That's Fishtron is now. It's now wired to fish. Actually, it's not wired to anything at the moment. I don't remember these flying snakes being in here the last time we came in the dungeon. Yeah. Now I've modified the. The teleporter to take us to fish drawn. Very nice. 
And I'm on my way to go- I'm on my way to the golem room. Yep. How many attempts at the golem do you think we should do? Uh, I don't know. Probably just the one is fine. Yeah. Unless we die. In theory, we can kill him a fuck ton of times. He's definitely gonna be a little easier now, though, that's for sure. Oh, there was a Plantera bulb! Huh. <laughs> more... More stuff to mess around with. Remember when those were hard to find? Yeah, now we just kind of find them without even trying. Okay, well here's the boss room. Uh, I need to bring the power cells. Oh yeah. Um, it should be in the chest. Yep, I have some. I have six. Actually, five. Sorry. Now the question is, can you teleport? I use one. Are you able to teleport to me? I'm going to assume not. <laughs> I'm on my way. These guys make some funny noises. Wow, 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 wow. 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 To think that the witch doctor is uh, the same species as these. <laughs> yeah, that's weird. Alright, yeah, I think this big ass fucking rainbow in the middle of the arena will do. Oh, fuck. Uh, do you have a wormhole potion? I do. Okay. Oh, forgot there's spikes up there. Wait, how many how many wormholes do I have? I have eight. So maybe when you get here I can give you a couple. Yeah, that will make the commute a whole lot easier. So the rainbows last for 40 seconds, and then they disappear. Rainbow. Double rainbow? What does that mean? Magically delicious. Oh, fuck. Lizards. <laughs> the Lizard King. I... I think you can actually break the uh, spawn thing so that we can take this teleporter up. <laughs> you can fight the golem wherever you want. If that's the case, then we never have to come back here unless we want to fight more than we have the teleporters for. Oh yeah, you're almost there. Okay. Alright, give me a sec. There's four, that's Thank basically you. half of them. And then I just heal and... Yep, and <laughs> we try to fight this guy again. He's teleporting all over the place. Wow, he's dead already. Oh, there's a better pickaxe. A better pickaxe? I think he drops a... Yeah, he has the pick saw. And now we don't have to come back. Because he dropped everything? <laughs> he got the pick saw. Now we, now we can take the thing back home. Oh. Um, I got something called the Keen Slinger. The Slinger? Let me see what that is. It shoots like it shoots like explosive needles. Did you get that already? Ooh. I forget. 
I have a nail gun, but uh shoots explosive bolts. Does it use any does it use any of my bullets? Uh well we now I now have a pick saw, which is technically a better pickaxe. Hmm. 768. And I placed it uh near our base. Ooh, okay. Ooh, weird ass uh weird ass weapon. Where is Oh, it has its own dedicated ammunition. The lizard altar, where is where should I, I put this? Actually, I, I've re I'm I picked it up. Uh there we go. Yeah, it's right here. Right here is a good spot. Do you wanna fight another one? Sure, why not? I can use his own weapon against them. Yee. <laughs> now unless we need to get more cells, we never have to go back. Do to my rainbow. Oh boy, he's taking a lot of damage. <laughs> he's fucking dead already. We drop this time. The golden mask, the hurtful heat ray. What the hell is the hurtful Ooh. heat ray? It also drops beetle husks, which I think is can be used to make banners. Oh god, I I. You summon I another. another. One. You spawned another one. Another one. Another one. I mean. I mean, it's all right. It's overrated as fuck. <laughs> I love it. Before the Moon Lord, if I'm not mistaken, he, for a few patches, he was the final boss. This guy. The Golem. Wow, what a weird ass final boss. Yes, keep standing inside my rainbows. No, you can't, don't avoid my rainbows. Ooh. Um, he dropped the possessed hatchet. I need to try all of this shit. Okay, what does this do? This is a laser gun. Kill Pinky. What? What do you mean, kill Pinky? The Hurtful Heat Ray. That's not better than my magic gun, though, is it? Okay, hang on. Murderous Shadow Beam Staff versus the Hurtful Heat Ray. You have the Hurtful Heat Ray? No. I do not. You want to try it out? <laughs> sure. I guess, uh, I guess I got a target to test it out on. Alright. Here, try, try it out. Where is he? <laughs> Where'd he go? D he killed him. Oh, there it is. <laughs> hey. I got the slimy saddle. Oh, I already have a slimy saddle, though. Yeah, rainbow. Taste the rainbow, motherfucker. Taste the rainbow, motherfucker. Oh yeah, let me try out those other weapons that I got. The possessed hatchet. Oh wow. <laughs> Wait, this is a like a boomerang or something? Pink gel. Oh. Beetle huff. What is this? Look at this fucking weapon. Ooh, an armored sunstone. I got. 
An armored sunstone during daytime grants a minor bonus damage. Neat. This does 80 melee damage. I always saw all this stuff. Um. Let me try putting on the golem mask. <laughs> that looks really bad with the Oh, yeah! Though. Pink gel! That means I can make bouncy grenades. Oh. Looks kind of bad. With and bouncy paint, dynamite. Though. What else can this bouncy pink gel make? Pink torches, bouncy grenades, bouncy bombs, bouncy dynamite, bouncy glow sticks, restoration potion. You know what? Pink slime sure. block, pink, pink gel dye, and bouncy boulders. You know what? I'm actually gonna... I think I might wear this golem mask. <laughs> you wanna kill another? I mean, I, I don't mind. Gun right, my rainbow gun ready. Just absolutely shredding golems now. Alright, come over here. I need you to jump into my rainbow. That's probably what a gay person would say. <laughs> jump into my rainbow. <laughs> jump into my rainbow. Yeah, he's dead. Ooh. I got a heat ray. Oh, another one. Nice. Here, here's yours. Here's your original one. <laughs> now I have one. Man, he drops a lot of good damn weapons. Let me, let me see. Um, what is the best golem weapon? Terraria. It's a very random question. I, I know. Golem. Let's see his draw. The best golem weapon is the Terra Blade. Really, no. No, that's that's what weapon's good against his body. I'm asking, what was the best weapon that he drops? <laughs> okay, the things he dropped. Golem fist, staff of earth. It's a pretty neat one. I have the golem. The hatchet's mm. not bad though. Even though it kinda has short range. Gee. Yeah. Oh it does say it, it homes in on the enemy. I'm a you know what I'm gonna fight him for shits and giggles. <laughs> I don't even have to- I don't even have to aim. The fact that you a for shits and giggles boss. I love how the golem is the shits and giggles boss now. Yeah, the thing about this hatch is I have to, like, be really close. For it to even work. But, I mean, it, it does damage as long as I'm just holding down the button. And I don't even have to aim it. That's the best part. Truly spectacular. Oh. Ooh, you got... I got a Pixaw. Pixaw? For you. Pixaw, it's a better pickaxe. Than your drill. Hmm. Hey, I got a golem fist. <laughs> that looks funny. It's a melee weapon. Well, here, here, this is... I think you run melee, right? I like to run a bit of both, honestly. Uh, over here. Wait, I'll drop it for you. We'll see. Ruthless Golem Fist. Hmm. Interesting. We're collecting some neat weapons. 
I don't know if I like this one much. My oh. laser machine gun has been replaced. But I'll put these in the chat. I'll put these- oh, this is the wrong chest, fuck. This is the weapon chest. And then, you know what? You know, I might, yeah. I might keep this hatchet, actually. He's kind of—he's—he's oh he's, 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 he's in the house. He, he, over here, lead, lead him away. I'm sir. trying to manage my inventory. Sir, over here. Sir, this is a McDonald. <laughs> sir, this is a Wendy's. Hmm. I'm—I'm I'm honestly wondering if the hurtful heat ray is better than the shadow beam, though. I think I might Raw damage it. wise, it's better than the heat than my uh my alien gun. Yeah. But fire rate I honestly think uh my alien gun is oh god he's coming at you. Oh boy. Well, he I'm, killed I'm, me. I'm probably dead. Z he's shooting these far in his lasers. Wait, where's the nurse? Takes me a long time to respawn, damn. Okay. Hmm. Honestly, though? I might- I might, um... Oh, she just decided to leave the house. Step out. Hang on. Not gonna lie, I'm thinking I might get rid of, um... I might get rid of the Morning Star. I think it's time. Come on! No! No! <laughs> not here! Not over here, good sir. Not, not over there. Sir? 100% pickaxe power. 210% pickaxe power. Capable of mining lizard bricks. Oh yeah, we can now mine the lizard bricks and use the traps. Oh, sick. For ourselves. Well, this is just a Pixaw base. I haven't even upgraded it yet. Okay, well I think it's finally time to get rid of the drill and get a Pixaw. Yeah, the possessed hatchet might be in my new melee weapon, honestly. I thought I just have four frickin' weapons. <laughs> like, I have so many now. Alright, I'm gonna use the bathroom again, and then I'll be right back. <laughs> Ooh, I got a new new weapon. Another one. Why are you in the house, good sir? Get out of the house! I love that you just keep killing a shit ton of golems. <laughs> I mean, I got a nice weapon out of it. Which I still think the heat gun is better. Bro. Out of the, the two uh, magic weapons that this guy drops. I right. mean, the earth... Oh, I, I think I understand why the earth staff is uh, not as good. Because it's, I got a broken quality one. Oh, 
Uh, he's in the house again. D <sighs> of course. All well, right. it's time to upgrade our shit, and we I think we can actually deal with the cultist now. I'm basically ready for the cultist. Wait, didn't you put? Didn't you set the? Didn't you put set the teleporter for Duke Fishron though? <laughs> oh yeah, we can fight Fishron first. We, we should we should try fighting him. Let me upgrade my uh, magic whipping. And I need to use my heal. Reforge. I forget what the beetle husks do. I think you can make Masterful. armor with them. Manic. Hurtful. Superior. Pleasant. I should have kept it in Masterful. Oh yeah, the beetle armor. The beetle armor is like some of the best physical like or like it's some of the best defensive armor yeah let's see creating the full set of beetle armor requires 18 beetle husks which i think i have actually I have 17. I think you have some beetle husks, though. I have 16. Yeah. We could almost make two sets of beetle armor. Uh, it's it also... Oh, oh no. <laughs> it also requires a full set of turtle armor. Oh, fuck that. So I can sell the beetle husks? Keep them, in case we do end up making uh, yeah. beetle armor. Oh yeah, we can... I think we can also attempt the Eternia. The what? <laughs> The turn oh yeah, turn air crystal? Yeah. Eh, I'm kinda burnt out on that. I kinda wanna fight fish wrong again. We haven't done that in a while. Okay. So I guess uh fish fishy fishy fish. Fish man. Fish man! You don't need to peel down and I Um, okay, so how do I use the bait? Uh hand me the truffle or I can give you the fishing rod. Well if you already have the rod, I'll just I I just give you the rod. Oh, <laughs> Okay, hold on. I mean, you can give me the rod. Uh, there we go. Yeah. Now that I have the bait. Oh, yeah. uh, where is my rod? There's my rod. Ah, shit. I don't have both my summons. That's okay, though. Oh, yeah. I should probably get my summon. Well. Yeah, you know what? Well, technically, well. Uh, we don't need to use the teleporter until... Uh, or, like... Until we get to, like, we have to deal with, uh, fish on. Well, let's, let's give it another shot. We have more defense and health, and we got better weapons. I'll get my rainbow gun set up, too. Okay. There Here he go. is. Oh, boy. Try how fucking aggressive he is. Fishy, fishy, fish. Fuck you. <laughs> hey, fuck you, Luigi. All right, all right throw my hat. Throw the hatchets at him. Okay, where is my heat gun? Fuck. Oh no. Stay alive. Oh, it's gonna be tough. Bob and weave. That. that Oh my god. He is still tough as balls. Yeah. I don't think I got his health down very much. We've got another attempt. We have one more attempt at him. <laughs> Alright, well... I mean, to be fair, I didn't have my greater healing potions set. Uh, where in the cinnamon toast fuck? There wait, it is. Wait, I'm stupid. I need to get my, I need to get my summons. Oh yeah, I should probably do the same. Yep, yeah, I need to heal anyway. I'll just stand near this crystal and get my health back real quick. 
Wait a minute. I can also do this. Damn. Yeah, good old Duke Fish Run. Let's see. Yeah, most players want to fight Duke Fish Run post Golem. Now well, fully, we're post golem. Now I'm fully healed. Okay. I think we're so past golem that, uh, or so post golem that post golem isn't even an accurate description. <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's get the rainbow ready. Fuck. You right. hurt. Not a good start. Ow. Oh god. Stay alive. I'm trying. Oh, the bubbles hurt. Bubbles really hurt. I have to run. I have to run to the healer. Nurse, 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 right, nurse, 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 nurse. Fuck. Those bubbles are rough. Uh, fuck, 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 fuck. I just chugged a potion and I'm gonna run to the teleporter. Fuck, 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 I fuck. Am, there I'm we go. about to die. I need that heal. There we go. Ooh, those bubbles are scary. <laughs> this is so tense. There's so many bubbles on screen. Aw, oh, shit. Sharktron, his name is now. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh balls, oh fuck, oh balls, oh fuck, oh balls, oh balls, oh fuck, oh balls, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh I think we have to reset. No! That was pretty good though, we got him down to 7,000 almost. Hmm. Yeah. Well, uh, I guess we could try the cultists then, huh? <laughs> yeah. And now I have to modify the teleporter. Yep. Let me get my grand design. Now he can definitely do that though. I was getting good at dodging his shit. I was doing well as well. Yeah, sometimes I wonder if this will be easier with three players because you know you get how you know you if you die, you know it's in you this get difficulty. Two... Yeah, the difficulty we're doing, yes. Ah, uh, yeah. In higher difficulty, I think it would scale with the, with the amount of players. Oh, I see. Okay, let me get my uh, summons. And where is the junction point? Oh, there are werewolves. <laughs> Suddenly werewolves. <laughs> Alright, we'll give the cultist an attempt, and then I might call it a night. 
It's, yeah. almost, it's almost two in the morning. And then I just we do the teleporter is now set up for cultists. Alright, let's see let's see if the cultists are even there. The cultists are not there. What? That's weird. None of the fuck? Hmm. None of the fuck? Le fuck? Does it have to do with the fact that I just read the ceiling? <laughs> uh, the ceiling should be irrelevant. Hmm. That's weird. So long as there's an a uh, Cthulhu orb to ponder. Well, and there's nothing down. They here. should be able to do it. You know, I come down. I come down here all the time. I never see any cultists down here. A giant skull. Yeah, unless there's something else in the dungeon I can do. I don't think so, though. Because I have, like, all the chests. Oh, do we, do we, need, we do need, like, a desert key or something. At least I think we do. Put Hellbat Banner. Oh, more ectoplasms, I guess. Sure, why not? Where are the cultists? Yeah, I don't know why the cultists aren't there. Wild Cobalt Shield. That's a new one. Now that was like a permanent one defense upgrade? I wouldn't mind. Man, those guys still do a lot of damage. Oh yeah, that's right, I have the wild paladin shield. That's still good. Truffles here. Truffle. I have the I have the thing that reduces healing potions cooldown by twenty five percent. Might as well take my frustrations out on the, uh, golem. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Well, maybe, maybe there's a way I can tinker some of my accessories. I don't know. That might, that might be the only other thing I could think of to give me a fighting chance. Defeat the current threat before you can use the pylon network. Nah, fuck you, game. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna walk over there. Oh, I uh, forgot I took my wings off. You uh, you discovered the meaning of defenestration. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that is. Uh, defenestration is uh the, the act of being thrown out the window. <laughs> That's amazing. To throw someone out a window. Okay, uh, let me use the desert pylon. There we go. There we go. He he dead. Where did the? There's the tinker. I want to see if I can reforge this stuff. Angry. Plus, Demonstration to throw someone out a window. Plus four defense. <laughs> All right. 
Ooh, okay, that's that's much better. Where that goblin at? Plus twenty mana. Interesting. Oh man, that's that's really tempting, honestly. Plus twenty mana, that's not bad. And then I reforge my gun. Oh, a demonic ray gun. Oh, that yeah, is you, nice. Yeah, you can't, uh... You can't, um... Oh, demonic staff of earth? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. Eh. Why do you keep giving me shitty? Why do you keep giving me shitty uh things? Okay, unpleasant pickaxe. What does beetle armor Pixel. give for benefit? It gives a lot of defense. I know that. Possessed hatchet. The keen possessed hatchet. It seems to be a melee armor. Alright, so I now have 52 defense. <laughs> Ooh, my defense. I have 53. Because what I did was I uh, tinker all of my accessories. And I got plus 2 defense on the Guardian Angel Wings. And plus 4 defense Ooh. on the Warding Apprentice's Scarf. I could do it for the um, Paladin Shield as well. But I, the Paladin Shield, I, I tinkered it, and it gave me plus 20 mana, which is not bad. I mean, plus 20 mana is pretty good, right? Yeah. And then I the, have no Mon Knees. No I moon, have no Moon Knees. The Spectre Boots give me plus 2 defense. Oh. You know what? Hmm. I'm gonna do a thing. I'm gonna do the thing of beating the shit out of the, uh... You're gonna beat another golem? Uh, <laughs> I'm out of golem things. Oh. <laughs> the Eternia. Okay, we could try the Eternia. And I'm assuming that would be definitely... Ah, uh, it's kinda... late. Kinda late? <laughs> yeah. Well, we could try this out. Where's my yeah? Where where's my? Where's my pillar? My my uh oh there it is, my clinger staff. Doing pretty good. Fire pillar. Keep shooting the shadow beam. I don't know what this uh, flame burst cane does. Don't let me use it though. All right, let's get the rainbow gun ready again. I'll just take care of the right side. <laughs> yeah, not gonna let any, uh... Not gonna let any of those damn wyverns escape. And I have these stupid-ass hatchets as well. Oh, I need to set up another rainbow. Okay, can't I put like a rainbow? Yeah. There we go. 
They stand no chance against me now. Oh, that was a good wave. You know what? Rainbow plus Clinger Staff makes it trivial for you. It really does. Attorney and mana. I'll just set up another rainbow. Like, the enemies can barely even get out of the damn portal. Jeez. Wait, I actually have a question. Does- I, What? Are my- are the lasers from my shadow beam reaching all the way over there? I don't think so. I don't know how far they're going. I'm just throwing boulders. <laughs> You're throwing boulders. No, Wyvern, bad. Bad Wyvern. Oh, my, my uh, rainbow's gone. That is easy. I mean, honestly, the only thing, the only enemies I'm really worried about are these damn dragons. Even then, they're a joke. Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at all these mana stars that are just... Oh, yeah, there. I have a possessed hatchet. Yeah, the ha possessed hatchet's pretty good. Oh, bad wyvern. I still think the staff of Earth is god tier. Woo! More mana, more mana for me. Yeah, I try to I try to go grab the mana crystal and it goes poorly. Oh, they're they're slightly they're slightly getting through my defenses. Oh, we got a boss. Oh, oh, we got another one another, on the other side. Uh, another boss? A necromancer, a dark mage. Ooh, he dropped a thing. A trophy. Okay, that was that phase. Uh oh. What are these skeletons doing here? Oh, uh, it was from the dark mage, the ones that I missed. Oh, crap. You know what? I'm gonna also play some music on the- or, like, to blast them. Taste the music, motherfucker! Oh, hey, Jose, how's it going? <laughs> sure, you can send me some videos later. Big boy. Am I helping with my boulders that I'm flinging at you? The boulders are definitely helping. I'm like really fucking slow now for some reason. Okay, he's dead. Ooh, dropped a thing. Well, why the hell am I so slow now? What the fuck? Oops. Is it because um. is it because of the fire thing that I put down? It might be that. I don't know. I summoned a thing. The ogre's back. <laughs> oh, he's dead. <laughs> I have like these fire sentries down now. God, I've been oozed apparently. <laughs> oozed. Is that why? Is that what makes you move so slow? Yeah. 
Can he keep his ooze to himself? Oh yeah, oh yeah, these fi these little fire sentries I put it down are actually doing something. Oh, get out of here. Get out of here, guys. What are you doing? These little fire sentries I put down are doing everything now. Oh, no dark rainbow. mage. We no magic. Rainbow. Oh god. He summoned skeletons. Oh boy. And he summoned an, he summoned the big ogre, dude. I might need a bit of help over here. Good. Okay, he's dead. Oh. Oh no. Ooh, that was a close one. Wow. I died. Uh, I'm gonna need help on the other side. Okay, I'll put our rainbow down there. Taste the rainbow, motherfucker. Taste the rainbow! <laughs> oh boy, oh, oh, big dragon. Oh, bestie. Oh, hi, it's the best, the big, big bitch. The big bitch, that's a huge bitch. I'm almost dead, also, by the way. It's the bestie. Want to get over there and get that health? There is a, I can't get it. Fuck. Um. This isn't good. <laughs> the attorney crystal's not looking too well. No. <laughs> The dragon fucking got it. Yeah, this is the big boss of this. We got him like half dead. Wow. So we know that's possible that too. Yeah. Honestly, we got some Maternia or Defender Metal. Honestly, I kind of want to try that again because we got so damn close. Uh, I'm gonna buy some stuff with the Defender Metals first. How many do I even have? I have 40. I have a gate, a gato egg. A what? A gato egg. I don't know what that is. Hmm. A uh, what? What is this? It's an equipable. Can you fuck off, you stupid fairy? No. Hang on. That goes over my, uh... Over this? Oh! Is that, is, does that, is that pet actually help me, or what? Or is it just a little fun guy to have around? Yeah, he doesn't do anything. Sure it's nice to have around, though. Wow, this armor. <laughs> hmm. I have a question. <laughs> can I... Can I, um... Tinker any of these? I get to summon the Dark Lord! You can't tinker these. That's too bad. Hmm. Oh, I won't need this. 
Their, their armor bad. is not bad. If not a tad expensive. I like the winged slime mount. Nearby players get a small bonus against Ethereum Javelin Thrower. Angry oh, Kobold! We have a Kobold banner. Hmm. What are the enemies from the uh, the Ethereum Crystal event? <laughs> or Eternia Crystal? Alright, let's see. I have... 40 defender medals. Mm. Man, so I got 150 to get the full Shinobi set. Uh, I have 25 that I can give you. Also, it's turned into a graveyard. Oh boy. Explosive trap staff. I have, yeah. Are you gonna buy anything with the Defender Medals? Uh, I was planning on getting the, uh, I think it's the Dark Armor, or whatever the fuck it's called. The Dark Armor? You can armor. view it. Oh, the Dark Artists? Yeah, that's the one. Oh. I think that's the one. I think that's the armor I'm thinking about. Yeah, the Dark Artist. It says, um... The one that gives magic damage and, uh, sentries. Uh, increases your max sentries by two. Hang on, compare that to what I have right now. Is that and is, summon and magic damage by fifteen percent? Not better, bad. Is that better than the Spectre equipment? It is. It is actually better than the Spectre equipment. Well, here with these with these sixty five medals, what I can do is I can buy. I could buy one of these staffs, but I don't know if that's worth it. Is it? Would it just be better to save up? I mean, I have the Ballista Cane. I mean, I have, a, I have the uh, Flame Burst cane, so, yeah. So if we want all, if we want, if we want that, we need a hundred, we need 300 Defender Medals in total. I'm just gonna put the Defender Medals in, um... Yeah, I'm gonna chest. put the Grand Design in, because that UI is driving me nuts. <laughs> yeah. And I'm assuming, uh, whoever's looking in chat is cringing. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Sleepy Octo Pet. Yeah, I'm gonna sell all this stuff. War so I'm assuming banner. we're gonna try it again? I mean, it is uh, currently, I think, 2 in the morning for you? Oh, I, yeah, but I wanna try it again, because I, I, we yeah. got so damn close. Yeah. You know, so I, let, me try, let me try something real quick. I'm gonna put some banners up before we start the event. Okay. I don't know if these banners will actually do anything, but... I think they should. I want to try, I wanna try it. Uh... Just put some banners up in here. We are officially a graveyard biome. Oh no. I don't know if any of these enemies actually show up in the in the event, but we'll try. Okay, do I have my summons? Yeah, the dragon is something that shows up, same as those throwers, or the beetles. I need to get my extra summon. <laughs> oh, well, too late now. I'll just take the right side, like I've been doing. It's not letting me mine the frickin' gravestones. What the hell? I can't mine gravestones with this pickaxe, that's weird. I still have the drill. I can clear them out. <laughs> well, now I feel like I should keep the drill, just so I can get rid of them. Oh, we can't remove them while the Eternia thing is active, I think. Oh, I see.
which is annoying. I love how fucking heroic this music sounds. <laughs> if you didn't know that this is a whole, a big old reference to Dungeon Defenders, that game. I mean, I'm pretty sure you said that before. Yeah, just, just in case I didn't. <laughs> well, this is technic this is a crossover to Dungeon Defenders. Oh yeah, Ethereum. I do have some banners from the Ether something Ethereum related, I think. So that'll yep. help. Ow, didn't want to take that damage. Uh where in the cinnamon toast fuck is my clinger staff? There's my clinger staff. Yeah, I hear you, damn bird. Damn birds, get out of here. so far. I have some sentries right now. And so do I. Let me know the rules. At least there's fucking turkeys coming out of the portal. So far, so good, though. Runs out at like the worst times. <laughs> Ooh, defend a metal. Can I not set up more, uh, more sentries? Okay. I've got three. I don't well, I, four. I don't, I don't know if I got any defender medals. that this thing uh, shreds through enemies. Just homes in, I don't have to do any of the work. Great. Do I have enough for another century? Nope. No. No, I don't. Oh boy. This is a magic guy. I think shooting up's probably gonna be the way to go. Another sentry. Perfect. Yee. Oh god, we got him. We got an ogre. Yeah, big boy. There 
gotta take care of these dragons. Or whatever they're called, I don't know. They look like dragons. Barely even getting out of the damn door. Oh no, he actually hit me. Crazy. <laughs> it really just sounds like a bunch of turkeys, honestly. Yeah, they are just turkeys. <laughs> Put another sentry down, yeah. <laughs> Eleven defender medals. This is easy. It's easy up until the last wave, and then it's just all, all hell breaks loose, really. Oh boy. We got, we got an ogre. Damn, bro, why does he go so fast? Alright, just to be safe, I might set the rainbow gun back up. There's a second one? Oh god, we have a dark mage. Oh, we got Yellingtons. Yeah, I'm taking a lot of damage. A lot of unnecessary damage, too. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. He's, he's near. He's near the Eternia crystal, and I'm dead. Yeah, we lost. Fuck. Damn. We made it to wave seven again too. That's the worst part. We came close. Yeah, we tried. I guess we'll have to give it another go next time. Oh God. And, okay, there's an eclipse. Random, random eclipse, I guess. The reason why I know this is because a random just vampire jumped on me. And now I see the moon. It's all weird. The sun. No, no, I'm not. I'm not in the mood to deal with an eclipse. I'm gonna just hop off. <laughs> yeah, solar eclipse. Yeah, fuck that. Nah, not dealing with that. We'll deal with that at a later time. Yeah. It's better if I just call it a night. Yeah. I need some shut eye. But hey, we. Yeah. I, I mean, I'd say we made progress. We're getting close to beating at least one of these bosses. Yeah. Like, uh, well, we didn't get to fight the cultist, sadly, because he didn't want to we show up. We had golems. Oh, yeah, we killed like 50 golems in one episode. Uh, fi yeah. Fish run got pretty close. Got him down to like 7,000, I think. And, um,. Yeah, Eternia Crystal is a bitch too, still. So I guess, uh. Good night to you. Yeah, I'll see ya. I'll see ya, man. But I'd be, I'd be down yeah. to, uh. Play more of this next week. Good night. Yep, alright. I'll see ya, man. Take care. See ya. Fireman Trainer went to go jack off. Went to go jack off. Alright, guys. Well. Thanks for watching Terraria. We had a nice three hour long stream. That's crazy. All right. Well, I had fun. Make sure to like and subscribe to on YouTube and Twitch. And I'll see you all in the next episode. So see you then.